Hello everybody and welcome back to Golden Dragon Games, I'm your host rocky 15 Today is just an update video, slash dragon vlog, actually I uploaded a video with a title of that, but problem is half of it I had to delete because the audio went, mind you I was having a bit of computer trouble yesterday so that's understandable, so this is going to be the re-uploaded version, but a couple of updates, first of all, two new videos Apart from this one today, possibly just one. It depends how much time I've got because I'm feeling pretty tired. Because I've been working on my cosplay for March Comic Con. But hopefully, the videos I'll be able to get done after this is the Minecraft 1.8 map Cracking World. And yes, I finally got some Minecraft 1.8 action coming for the channel. Also, I've got a review of this, the second Lego Ninjago set in the tournament. The Tournament of Elements Collection. Also, I've got, and these are just some future ones I'm about to show you if I've got a review. Jay's Mac, the Anachondri Crusher. I have also got the Lego Superheroes Justice League set here. Mind you, it's not called Justice League sets here over in the UK. Minecraft The First Night. I got Minecraft the Cave set. I got. Well, you might have just caught snip little glance that. It was uh, some custom drawers mask figures. You might be saying, I've already done those, but I've upgraded one and created one, two, three, four, five. About five or six new ones, but also I got this Lego Ender Eye I made um, off of. A design that another YouTuber called Zatsy Zombies or something like that um, had on his channel, and I thought I make myself have the challenge of making that. Actually, I made that before I even started this YouTube stuff. So um, that's more stuff to review, but also just to show you a sneak peek at something. Yeah, I got to review all that stuff. Because I have got so many new Lego projects. I've got updated Minish Cap project. Um, the figures aren't updated. I might make one new one just to make the showcase, you know, worthwhile for watching. Because people have already seen the figures before, which was Link and Varty. Um, but I managed to get some Shapeway custom four swords and I got five of them so four for each element and the fifth one for being the actual fourth sword I've got all Korea time um, based Lego customs Suicide Squad for the DC superheroes movie Suicide Squad coming out next year um, Wind Waker Lego minifigures again I know I've already done them but I made so many new figures I've Redone Lincoln Tingle. Um, I've redone for Kenny Red Lions again, Shapeways accessories. I got Metroid, some Lego Ninjago customs, um, Skyward Sword, and Hyrule Warriors, but also a miscellaneous Lego Batman figure, which are just slightly. If you can guess who that is. I'll tell you, Red Hood, Jason Todd. But also I got some Donkey Kong minifigures, but also upgraded Twilight Princess Lego minifigures. Showcase to show you. Oh, it's really hard getting down onto my knees, especially in my room. Actually, that's another thing to mention. I've got a room called a study downstairs, believe it or not. Uh, but I'm basically going to redesign all of it, move all my consoles into there because that's where the Wi-Fi router is and then I'll be able to record console gameplay from my Wii U and also Wii because I bought this to record off the Wii but the thing that records for the Wii U um, needs to be plugged into it. Um, your internet router and unfortunately my internet router isn't in my living room and there's no way to move my internet router so and also I needed the study redone anyway. So it's going to be um, 
basically my new office slash gaming room, which will be cool. So get a new TV in there. About um, me and my mum looked at the space. We're gonna put the TV in about 34 inch TV. Um, get a nice desk in there, some shelving units because of course my mum will probably want to store stuff in there as well. But also uh, get one or two bean bags. I'm gonna even get myself a gaming chair. It's going to be so cool, but it's probably not going to be done till the end of summer. And by summer, I mean summer this year, 2015, so August, September, I'm going to say. But it all depends on money-wise, you know. Also, well, actually everything depends on money. And my camera is supposed to also focus. That's better. So... That's basically it for an update, but while I check how long this video's gone on for, I'll give you a beautiful view outside of my window. Okay, we've been going for six minutes now, so that's probably not enough. So, thank you everybody for watching, and remember to... This camera zooms in weirdly. Don't do that camera. Thank you. Um, anyway, so remember to leave a like, favorite, share, subscribe, and also comment on what you think my next project should be. And also, one more piece of information, I am finally sending my 3DS XL off for modifying in Japan to fit mini USB and I will finally be able to record properly from 3DS console instead of pointing the camera I'm using at the moment at the screen so it wobbles about and stuff. So, that's good. Mind you, I'm having a bit of trouble posting off by UPS, my um, colleague, Rick Daddy. Um, he drove in his car 45 minutes to East Bristol today to the UPS headquarters which is the nearest one near me and uh, they just asked all sorts of ridiculous questions passport you know that sort of thing I don't know what they thought the package was because it's just a 3DS XL and the battery is of course being taken out along with the SD card and stylus um, so yeah that was a bit complicated so we tried doing it online on the computer but we were having difficulty with that also but Brick Daddy said he would sort it out and for me not to worry so I reckon two to three weeks possibly a month from this video we should be able to pick up re well re-pick up the Alpha Sapphire playthrough which will be great but also I'll be doing Majora's Mask as well so got two new projects for the future but of course those won't be coming till the 3DS comes back modified and also Pokemon Ruby the original version that series will be picking back up along with more mod, mod reviews for Minecraft 1.7.10 also 1.64 because I haven't finished all of those yet for the channel also Minecraft Adventures Till the End and Beyond will be hitting the screens very hard and by very hard I mean I'm basically rebooting it so incredibly hard that it's going to be amazing it's going to blow your mind and I will make some sort of epic trailer for that also when that series is ready to return but also, in the meantime, I'll be playing Minecraft 1.8 maps. Like I said, I got a brilliant one called Kraken World. I'll probably do the Alien Isolation one. Maybe Bane of the Pumpkin Lord, because I've seen all the three of those played through on YouTube multiple times by multiple famous YouTubers. So I thought I'd give it a go myself. Also, I created a new uh, 1.8 skin, which will be cool to show off, hopefully, either tonight or tomorrow. Again, I said I'm trying to get out two videos tonight, but it all depends. Also, it depends if this video either A, loses the audio for one or two, ends up being half corrupt, 
or all girls, I don't know. I'm just, you know, hoping, hoping. But anyway, I was actually seeing the outro. What was I saying? Hang on, let me just check my notes. Uh, yes, before I went rambling on about the 3DS and all that jazz, uh, I was saying goodbye because it's supposed to be the end of the video, but sometimes I always, you know, go over. Okay, but anyway, thank you everybody for watching. Remember to leave a like, favorite, share, subscribe, comment. And I already said all that once, but never mind. And until next time, stay frosty, stay golden, and bye -sies.